Hi everyone and welcome to Billy Fitzgerald Golf and today I want to give you a drill that will help that chronic slicer off the tee. Whatever you do, you can't make the ball go straight or left. You tried strengthening your grip, twisting the face, more body rotation, whatever you try to do, nothing seems to work. So hopefully this drill will give you a little bit of hope. So the first thing we do is set up to the ball how you normally would. This is called back to the target drill. The next thing you do is turn your back to the target. Yes, fully to the target. So my feet are in line with my golf ball. Now in order for my arms to stay soft, I'm gonna have to, as you can see, I moved a little bit closer to the golf ball. Now that I'm set up, I'm gonna make a few practice swings. Now the club is gonna go straight back. I'm gonna mimic what my, my swing typically does. Now, the biggest mistake I see is that because my body is so open, as you can see, my right hip and my right shoulder are away from the golf ball. That gives my arms a lot of room, which is good, but don't allow the club to swing to the inside too much. We'll bottom out back here and end up hooking it a little bit too much. So, back to the target. Again, the face of the club goes, goes straight back now and right over my right shoulder and arms down in front. This allows you to feel what it's like to swing down with the club in front of you and not behind you. A lot of times what happens is, is we get up and we move straight into the golf ball. My hands go into the golf ball, the face gets left behind, and the face is open. So as you can see here with back to the target, it allows me to feel the club to come down in front of me. As you notice when I hit that, my right heel stayed on the ground. That allowed the club to come down in front of me, the handle swings down, the head goes out, and I'm able to feel what the release in the golf club is like. So again, back to the target drill, and I hope this works for you.